Southern California is home to some of the most extreme landscapes in the world. And there's none more extreme than its Death Valley. It's not only the driest place in America, it's also the hottest in the world. In 1913, temperatures here reached 134 degrees Fahrenheit, which remains to this day the hottest recorded temperature on Earth. What makes Death Valley a truly daunting landscape for humans is this, a seemingly endless expanse of flat, cracked earth that covers more than 200 square miles. It's known as Badwater Basin. The floor of this valley is actually salt that drained down from the surrounding mountains and then dried up here. The patterns the dried salt makes are virtually untouched by humans or machines and are one of the wonders of America's national parks. And they're constantly changing. Every time it rains in Death Valley, the salt crystals here form and reform into entirely new patterns. As seismic forces push the mountains around the basin higher and higher over millions of years, the basin itself got pulled further and further down. It now lies 282 feet below sea level, which means it has the lowest elevation of any place in North America. There's no doubt that this is one of the most extreme environments anywhere on Earth. Southern California may be known for its many forbidding landscapes, but Southern California isn't entirely a desert land, especially here in the Central Valley, one of the most productive agricultural regions in the world. On many Central Valley fields, there's no sign at all that California is suffering the worst drought in its recorded history. Thanks to aquifers, sprinklers are hard at work, turning what would be otherwise dusty farmland into fields of gold. With some of the best soil in the nation and 300 days of sun a year, the Central Valley produces more than 25% of all the produce consumed in America.